Hello, my name is Karx82, and welcome back to our new factory playthrough. Uh, last episode, we got a little more progress towards the simulation chamber. And uh, like we mentioned before, there is like three kind of big things that we're kind of working towards. And um, kind of, I'm not quite there with the blast furnace yet. I'm kind of put that off a bit, but I think maybe working towards um, AE obviously is pretty great. And this um, simulation chamber, I'm kind of like excited to check it out. Now that we have um, upgraded our power a little bit, I think that could be pretty cool because I have no idea how this actually works. Now, if we take a look at the batteries, um, we can use the Greg Tech batteries, but the these flux capacitors just have so much more power in this. This has 10 million RF, which translates to 2.5 million EU per tick, whereas this only has 100,000. So I think we're going to go ahead and do that. Yeah. And we're going to use these from now on, I think. Um, pretty different from using Greg Tech batteries that I'm used to, but these flux capacitors are just so much better. And we can just continue to upgrade them if we want. And it's like really cheap too. So I think we're gonna, we'll do that, I think. Is there a, there is a creative. Man, look at that creative recipe. <laughs> it's a very satisfying looking recipe. I don't know, I like the way they've done that. All right, ooh, hello. Yeah, that's, that looks really cool. That looks exciting um, to work towards it. Although zero point models, yep, there we go. <laughs> Man, there's a lot of cool stuff. I'm like really digging some of the end game stuff in this pack. So uh, it gives us something cool to work towards. So we need just a few of these ingots, I think. And I've been kind of, I haven't been smelting all this stuff down because I was kind of waiting to macerate it, but um, we are still getting more, more coins than we're spending. So I'm not super worried about that yet. I should oh I have I have it on me. The redstone I think we'll probably worry about uh sulfur. Yeah, I just want to get three of these batteries. I don't think we need any more of this. I don't know. Um because you're gonna have to upgrade all the cables and i i don't know if we need to do that quite yet we may but um some people are saying to use a 16 slot kind of thing 16 is that i can't i don't remember like cf do they don't have they do have slots all right so there's a four slot and a 16 slot all right well that's that's good to know so Oh, okay. I didn't realize. No, I guess that makes... So it's two amps. Yeah, that's... No. I'm trying to... 512 forge energy is... divided by 4, 164 EU, which is two amps. Okay, that makes sense, yeah. All right. So it looks like it can just pull what... I don't know. I actually don't know if it depends on... The amount of batteries in there, I don't know if that depends on how much amps it can pull or it can just always pull it. Well, it does say maximum, so maybe that's just if you have four batteries in there. I don't know. We, I'm sure that will <laughs> come up at some point, but I think for now we're good with the four. So we'll just let that, you know, fill up. And uh, might as well. I mean, we're producing more steam than we're using. I think we are... I mean, it looks like we're almost perfect. One of these runs. One of these... Well, well it's not augment. It's not... I don't know if you can... Can you upgrade these? 
with the augments with the this in there? Like, does a generation cannot be throttled? Steam is only produced. Oh, there it generation cannot be throttled. That was my thing that I was like, it's still burning. But... Yeah, if you upgrade this, does that change that? I actually don't know. There's a very slight gain with this output. That's good to know. All right, so we got the flux capacitors in there. And we'll just let that fill up. It's going to take a long time to fill those up. But uh, uh, well, maybe in there. This is kind of like I need a battery, or not a battery. Oh, I have sulfur right there. Put it in there so I saw it. I wish it didn't organize both inventories <laughs> if you right click. I need a I need um I need a chest that has stuff that I'm like never gonna use again. I'll probably never use those batteries ever again, just because the other ones are so much better. But I don't want to get rid of them completely. So I usually kinda uh, I could put it right in between there. This is my, I don't need it clogging up my chest with stuff I'm never going to use again. So, all right, uh, what do we want to do? Should we go ahead and try crafting this up? I did get the three electronic circuits. It's actually not too bad with these work tables, actually. Because I can just like, oh, I'm missing this. Just put a stack of that in, click, click, click. There we go. We got three circuits. So do need this though. Ah, right. String. Ah, uh, yeah, we're not quite there yet. <laughs> um, what will be these? I know we could, we can get this from the thing eventually, but I guess like, wait, white wall gives you four string, but pulverizing it only gives you three with a chance. All right. That needs to be adjusted. <laughs> It's actually kind of pointless. I guess white wall. Uh, do we have any? I don't really have any sheep around here, actually. No, I'm thinking about it. All right, let me get a bunch of string. I'm gonna need. Oh, I have some, but I need. I need. Yeah, I need more. Dang it! All right, let me grab some and we'll come back. All right, change of plan. I think I'm just gonna go ahead and buy some sheep uh, things uh, because there is like no sheep around here and I don't feel like dragging a sheep over and all sorts of stuff. So why don't we just do that? It is five coins, not the cheapest, but at this point we have a decent amount of coins. So let's just do that. And the cool thing is it gives you two. So we can breed them together and get some more sheep. And I just did a little gates kind of thing or a little fenced in area there we go and i think i have yours right yeah and there we go i figure this is probably the easiest just because it does seem that we're going to need quite a bit of string oh and also if you're breaking glass don't be happy in your sword in your hand because it actually does use durability. I thought that was actually kind of funny. I didn't realize I was using durability when I was breaking grass for um, some seeds. I made uh, I got a bunch of seeds and planted them over there for the wheat. Um, sword. What was the this again? File and hammer. There is my sword. All right, so wool. And then it was coal dust, right? Is that what it was? Yeah. And then that. I'll throw that in there. That away. No. 
What was it again? What was that? Oh, it's four pulsating dust to one. Just kidding. Is that enough? That is not enough. Uh, it's like uranium, wasn't it? Uranite. Oh, do I not have? Oh, I do have more. Throw that in there. Base Raider. Well, you predict. Oh, we're producing way more than that, though. Now I forgot. Yeah. Does this have a portable scanner? Ah, oh, it doesn't have a scanner in this. Yeah. Or, man, I love the portable scanner where you can click on things and see how many bolts are going through and all sorts of stuff. Yeah, that is really cool. All right, so we need, we only need two more. Do that. That. Oh, we smelt it again. I should get a... A furnace as well, so we don't have to keep doing that. Although that is probably much, much quicker than a yeah, that's probably much, much quicker than a basic electric furnace. Maybe I won't do that. Um, I mean, I guess sugar cane would probably work in there, wouldn't it? <laughs> but unfortunately, we are not. Producing too much of a excess? I don't know. This does work, right? I'm assuming. Need something to air redstone. Those need lots of that. Yeah, <laughs> you can use sugar cane in there. That is hilarious. Right. Maybe something to think about. We don't really need it though, uh, because charcoal is quite easy to get in this pack. Anyway, enough of rambling. What else do we need for the... Oh man, I forgot the name of what we're... Simulation chamber. Let's put that. Oh, we have almost everything except for this dark steel machine hall and a glass pane. Yeah, the only issue is if I not... I don't like smelting up that unless I'm like I'm wasting it but oh well that in there so deep machine hall so we need eight of the uh, that's actually ooh, nah, that's a bit annoying yeah that one's a bit annoying still 11. Nope. 11 of those. Do I have any? I don't have any. Oh, I do. Yeah, that's right. Man, I had to think there for a second. All right, and after this, Loot Fabricator. What are we looking at on? Nope, that's not. How to spell that? Ah, tier two. Okay, so this is a little bit of out of our league. I think this is after. Yeah, this is after the blast furnace. And that is why you need a mixer. All right, so that's making a bit more sense. All right, so this is going to be after the blast furnace. But I would like to at least get this finished here. What else are we looking at? Basic autoclave is something else we also need to do. Uh, the pump. Man, that pump recipe. I don't know what it is about it. It just feels so bad. <laughs> Why do you feel so bad? Oh, that's not what I want to do. Man, I hate how it, it clears it out. I don't think it actually clears it out, but visually it does. Don't ever click on this when you have it saved over here. 
I think it's that. That just kind of feels bad. Where is that? And the last plate here. I want to get the manual so I can take a look at that as well. It's kind of why I wanted to get this. There is that. And there we go. Simulation chamber from Deep Mob Learning. All right, and we get some coins. And yeah, there is the manual, which is pretty cool. Yeah, I'm going to have to do look at a lot of I'm going to have to uh, look a bunch of this stuff up. Yeah, I'm not going to read this while I'm kind of here. Data about the mob manually. Hmm, interesting. All right. Uh let me uh let me think what we want to Uh, electrical steel, yeah. So let me do a bit of looking up here, and I think I want to. Oh man, I really need to be going towards the blast furnace as well. All right, so we have two machines we're gonna need to craft up a mixer, which is pretty easy, and the autoclave. So why don't we go ahead and I'm gonna cut here and craft those two things up and we will be back all right as i was crafting up some of the components for this actually the the pumps that we need we need magnetic iron rods and i realized um let's go ahead and grass up the polarizer because it's super cheap doesn't require anything some tin cables iron in the hull so let's do that that will let us polarize these iron rods Oh, apparently we had a quest for it. I don't see a quest anywhere for it. Hmm, interesting. What if it's like... Ah, right there. Didn't even realize that was open. All right. Look at me doing quests and I didn't even know that was thing. All right, did that? All right, those always connect. There we go. There is the iron rods. So yeah, that is super cheap and you get it pretty early on. Doing that. Ah, uh, because it's locked. Rubber rings, right. There's so many like little fiddly things with this, these pump recipes. I think that's why I don't like them. Everything? No. What are we missing? Wrench? No. Motor. Thin cable rubber rings. Medium bronze pipe. Screwdriver. Tin ah, screw. Yeah. I had to think there for a second what, what you needed for a screw. Should probably get a lathe as well. Make easy screws. Right, is that it? Yeah, there we go. So there is that that. And uh yeah, okay. I just wanted to show the polarizer. Uh, you should get that kind of early on as well. Let me finish crafting up this stuff here. We need a couple machine hulls. Pieces of steel. And, uh, yeah, we'll come back. And we're back. And I think, uh, I think this is everything. No, I was mistaken. <laughs> I needed one more glass. All right, I smelted up a bunch of my magnetite. Really? Nuggets give you, uh, I guess give you an experience. I didn't know that. <laughs> uh, 
let's go ahead mixer and autoclave cool and i guess we'll just i don't know should i i guess i don't need this chest like right here i just have a couple things Maybe throw it down here on the side. No, it's just the the molds and stuff. And I had some charcoal for the the steel. There. Yeah, the only issue is if I like do that. <laughs> yeah, that kind of blocks that. I don't know. I'll think about that uh, in a sec. So let's claim that. That and also this repeating quest. That is so annoying because this never goes away. Anyway, just thought I would. Why? Oh, is there something? Maybe there's something I'm missing on here. Just look at that. Oh, it's right there. Just kidding. <laughs> I was thinking maybe there's some hidden thing that I completed, but it's not showing or something. But no, that was the auto click play. All right. So. Right, that is, that's blocked behind this, right? So, okay, so I need to, we'll do this one episode by itself. I don't, we're kind of splitting myself up here too much, I think. Oh, here's the snad quest. I did hear about this quest and I didn't know where it was. This is for the, um, the sugar cane. This is a quest to craft up the sugar cane, but... We've already done it. <laughs> ah, vacuum chest, but... Oh, now that we have an autoclave... Can do that. Oh, actually... I think I need to... That's... That's not a good place for the autoclave. I'm gonna need a bit more conductive iron. I put the. I had redstone, didn't I? What did I do with it? I keep losing stuff. Did I have redstone? Oh well. I don't remember using it all. Oh, did I put it in here? No. I have no idea where I put it. Oh well. There's redstone. Order. Wait, can we make this in the a thing now? Oh, we can. That's much easier. So we should move this autoclave and put it over here next to this so we can auto input some fluids. That is totally not where I wanted to put that. couple of these. Actually, we grab a bunch of these. Because we're probably going to need them. All right, so there is the forex. See, if now if I had the 16 battery buffer, I would need to craft up. 16x cables to do this and I don't particularly feel like doing that. All right. So, now we can input if we need to put like that recipe for the vacuum chest is a diamond with pulsating iron. I can just throw the pulsating iron in there and we'll get it in the autoclave. I'm not going to do this right the second cuz we don't need to. Um Yeah. I don't know. Let's just keep going this way, I guess. Be powered with RF or use a new only. I wonder if you can't charge it with. Do I have Certus quartz? Oh man, I did see a vein and I didn't mark it down. Oh well. <laughs> 
Like I said, we're getting so many more things. I could... That's... that's not really how I wanted to do that. <laughs> There's that. Oh, you do. That's how you... Alright, you actually do need it that way. Or you can do it that way. Ah, uh, no. It's the Surge Squirt's Dust. Alright, it was... Oh, I put that in the pulverizer probably. Alright, so that goes in the compressor and that will go to the plates. Alright, so this is kind of going a little bit different route than I thought we were going to today, but... Ah, Dark Steel. I don't think I have... Oh, I do have five. That was... just happened to have enough. Maybe it... Maybe it planned that, actually. The 12 Dark Steel, maybe that was enough for that as well. I don't know. If that had planned that, that is pretty cool. So this... it doesn't sound like this works on Greg Tech Power. I'd have to connect it to, like, here, I guess. Not the end of the world. And then this will charge the... Yeah, this will give us the charged thing. Now, the energy acceptor... All right, LV machine hall, electrical steel we gotta do, and these, and... Yeah, charge service, that's right. I, it's all coming back. It's all coming back to me now. <laughs> there we go. So I guess we can just like, throw that right there, right? No. It only gets charged from... Oh, that's, that's steam. That's not power. Yeah, I think it only gets charged from the top. But all right. So that has got power. Oh, I should have... Let's just double check. Does this have... Does it have key power? No, it doesn't. Let's see if it charges on that. No, it doesn't look like it's going to connect, so. It has to be RF or A2 power. So the charge shirtus. Don't think I have any. Oh, you can do the energetic confuser as well. Should just go mine some of this but we put water in the autoclave that will work too did i ever do i have a tank no i never did i craft up the regular this tank i think i used it in something i did craft one up but i think it got used Oh, I don't have any. Maybe not. I'm not seeing any. Wait a second. That's right. <laughs> Man, I need to get a, I think a lathe, maybe. Well, we only, we only get eight from that. Glass. And I just need to get a whole bunch of glass. Alright, blue tank right there. So if we do this there. The bucket on me. There, and then these tanks are just so helpful trying to get actually I just, this is Greg Tech Community Edition. I can just do that to get this stuff in. I totally forgot about that. Anyway, the fluid tank is definitely helpful, but you can just, yeah, you can just click on this and it'll go in there. Not by itself. Um, service. I guess just pulverize this then. 
going to take a second, though. I don't think this will work, no. I just want to get this... I want to get this charge sort of quitzel and then maybe craft up the energy acceptor because that is pretty cool to uh, be there already in the pack. And it's definitely more efficient to do this when you have a whole stack. But uh, I'm pretty sure this is, oh, this is not slow. Is this a percent chance though? I feel like this may be percent. No, that's not what I wanted. Ah. Just pulverize those down. <laughs> I need, all right. There, I think there's two different types of Surtis here, isn't there? Is that what I am? Oh, you put, put that in. There is two types of Surtis and there's this one and then there's the AE one. All right, so I thought you had to do that. I was, yeah. That's how you got it in Greg Tech New Horizons. That goes in there. There we go. Got some charge Surtis. Can even do. See, why does some of it. Like sometimes it goes really quick and then sometimes it goes really slow. And I have no idea what determine. Is it just random? Like, look how long this is taking to charge up compared to the other one that was like in almost instantaneously. Oh my goodness, I feel like I, where did I put that? Did I just, I swear to God, I'm losing redstone. Did I just use the redstone? Didn't I? Oh my goodness. I had 24 redstone or something, didn't I? I don't remember. Another quartz, I do. So let's just get some of this fluic stuff and probably call it there for today. All right, Um. so I was had kind of... There we go. Looks crystal. I was kind of planning on doing the deep mob learning, but I kind of got pushed into the uh, A, getting started in A, so I am fine with either. Um, but I'm going to have to get some of this electric steel, and we have a couple things we need to get going here. Silicon and steel. Ooh, silicon. I don't know if we have silicon yet. But uh, anyway, we'll get more into that next episode, I think. So anyway, that's going to be for today. Thanks for watching, and have a good one.